Hey everybody, this is Richard. I'm the founder and lead developer at algorithmictrain.net. I wanted to do a video just showing you the smart pivot algo, the, the three version. And so what I'll be doing in this video is just showing you um, what the strategy looks like and we're gonna be looking at some live trades. So right now we're in uh, two S&P contracts on the smart pivot strategy. We bought on the day trade long, which is uh, this strategy right here. And then we also bought on the Emerald, which is this one up here. And so we are, like I said, in two, uh, two different S&P trades right now. The stops are pretty tight at about $350 each. And so if, if we hit the stop, you know, it's, it's never fun, but it's not, it's not a big deal really because the, the gains that we can make on these algos are pretty big where the, the loss, especially on this kind of trade, is pretty tight at $350. So on a 25K account, you would be trading uh, two contracts right now. So you would be long one S&P up here and then one up here. And so I'll let the video run a little bit and we'll just see how the day goes. And when I'm done or when the day ends or when we exit these trades, I'll do a recap of what, what the final results were. And so, um, yeah, I think, let me do the risk disclosure real quick though. So just remember that trading futures and options involve substantial risk of loss. It's not appropriate for all investors. Remember, I'm not a CTA, I'm what's, what's called a third party developer. I offer the algorithms to be traded under what they call a letter of direction. And finally, remember that past performance is not indicative of future performance. And yeah, there's definitely risk involved in, in trading. And so um, come into, you know, if you're gonna move forward with, with this kind of thing, just come into it with eyes wide open, there's risk. And again, in these videos, you know, I do highlight the good. So we don't, every trade's not a winner though. We do have losing trades. And so just keep that in mind as well. But as it stands right now, we're in two contracts. It's pretty much break even right now. Um, I guess this one's up just a tiny bit and then this one is pretty much break even. So let's just see what happens though. Thank you again for watching and, and I'll let the video run. When I do the editing, by the way, I'll speed it up so that you don't have to wait um, seven hours for the market to close. Okay, so what we're looking at here is still the smart pivot, and uh, as the day has gone on, the, the s and just really traded sideways, but it recently started breaking out of this trade. So it's up a little bit, but the smart pivot is in both of these uh, trades. It's in the Emerald and also the day trade um, V1. And so, you know, we'll have to see what happens, but these, these three algos make up the smart pivot trading system. Now, the other thing that the smart pivot will do, though, is at the end of every month, it runs a sorting algorithm to determine which strategies of about the 300 that I have, it thinks will do the best for kind of the next month. And that's that's kind of what it does. And so it, it is a smart pivot. So it does kind of pivot if it thinks that, that there's an edge to be made. Now, the reality though, is that it tends to pick the, these three are the main ones that have outperformed. And so it'll it'll go with these until another one starts to do a little bit better. And even then, it's it's a fairly complicated algorithm that it that it runs to determine which strategy uh, it, that it's going to use. But this is the smart pivot trading system. It it is up a decent amount for the year, about forty three percent. Now that's in the hypothetical account, though. So keep in mind all the disclaimers. But what you're looking at here is really just the. I mean, these are uh, trades happening in real time on the on the sim account and trade station now. The way it works though is that my clients have accounts opened with one of the auto execution brokers and there's a couple different ones you can choose and those trades are placed automatically by the broker so the broker is has a setup similar to this and as trades get placed then they automatically get routed to the to the appropriate client accounts but yeah that's really all i got for the the smart pivot though i just wanted to, to have some comments for you and let, let's just see what happens throughout the day though um as it stands right now though, it's it's up uh, just a little bit, but we really need it to kind of, to kind of break out with some strength and then, um, and then we'll have to just see what happens after that. All right, let's see what happens. Thanks again for watching and I'll fast forward when I do the editing. Okay, so as the day goes on, uh, so far it's held onto the gains. Um, and just to give you an idea what these are, so this is, we got in about 45.29. Right now, the market is about 45.41, so that's about 11, uh, about 12 points. Now, each point is $50, so that's a gain of about $600 on this trade, and on this one, it's going to be about the same, because I think the fill was about the same. Yeah, 45.29, so we're up about $1,200 on, on these two trades for today, and so, so far, uh, this has been a really good day for the smart pivot. 
Now, um, it also, you know, obviously these algorithms are traded in other systems as well, in the Elite Trader, um, in Noble, Paladin, and a lot of those. But I'm talking about the Smart Pivot here, and these are the three strategies that are that are traded in it. And Smart Pivot has done really good this year. Um, but again, as I mentioned, that's that's in the hypothetical account. Um, but these these algorithms themselves have been live for a very long time, just not all together. The Smart Pivot is is a newer kind of uh, kind of compilation of, of the different strategies so yeah but as, as of now um, the market uh, has continued to rally now I want to talk about the emerald long just briefly because I don't think I've done that yet in the context of the smart pivot but what what this emerald long does is if you look up here you'll see these dotted lines and so what it's what it's trying to do is determine are we in a strong up a weak up a weak down or a strong down kind of market and every time a candle is created it makes it does the analysis it runs through a bit it's looking at about 15 different things and it says okay I think we're in a strong up or a weak up and as long as there's no forward slash then that's what then the algorithm is, has made a decision and so once you get a forward slash that just means that that it thinks that we're not in that kind of market anymore so basically after the market opened about 20 minutes later the algorithm determined i don't think we're in a strong down and i don't think we're going to be in a weak down kind of day so that left uh strong up and weak up and then every time the candles created you get a new um kind of uh tilde formed and then if there's ever a forward slash then that means it doesn't think we're in that kind of, of strategy again or uh, state again now, if you look here, this candle was just formed, and I don't know if you saw it, but that one kind of created another. So it, it means that, yeah, it still thinks we're in a strong up. And so as long as it thinks we're in a strong up, it's gonna hold on to the, to the position. As soon as it thinks we're not in a strong up anymore, it'll look to get out. Now, we have another 50 minutes before the equity markets close, and, so, um, and these are day trades, so they will get out at, at some point. Um, Either they'll get stopped out, uh, they could, you know, the, the Emerald could decide that it's not in a strong up anymore and, and get out a little early. But if it continues the way it is now, then it's going to hold until the close. And, and at the close, it's going to get out again because of, these are day trades. The um, Geronimo ES, that's this one over here. Now, that one had a really good trade a couple days ago right here. This was about a $2,000 trade. And I, I might have already mentioned that on this video, but, but it was a, a great trade. Um, I think that what I'll do now is I'll just let it run and then when the market closes I'll come back and, and kind of do a final analysis on, on where we ended up. But just remember that the smart pivot strategy is it trades the top three algos that we have, the top three strategies. These are fully automated, meaning um, there is no uh, human intervention needed. You don't have to watch the chart. I mean, in essence, what you do is you, you sign up and you open an account with one of the brokers that support the algorithms. And then the broker helps you open the account, fund it, um, you know, so you put your trading capital in that account. And the Smart Pivot 3 requires a $25,000 account. So if you were to move forward, you'd open an account with a minimum of 25K. Um, and by the way, if, if you took losses, you, you'd be fine. That, that's big enough to withstand um, a, a fairly large drawdown. So you shouldn't ever have to add capital, although you never know, um, but you shouldn't have to. Um, but what you do is you open the account with about 25K. And if you were trading this in the last, um, well, today, you would be up um, about, uh, let's see, yeah, about maybe 700 per contract now. So maybe up about $1,400 total on a 25K account. So that's, um, you know, somewhere, I don't know, is that around 7% somewhere in there? Um, so not bad at all. The uh, we've, It's been a really good day. Just keep in mind too, though, that, that I am showing the algorithms in a very positive light. You know, we do have losing trades, we have losing days, but these are uh, fully automated and, um, and I look forward to answering any questions you have. So if you have questions, why don't you reach out? But I'll go ahead and stop talking and let the video run. When I do the editing, I'm just going to speed it up so that we don't have to wait around. And then I'll, I'll come back and do the final analysis once, once the market closes. All right, so the market just closed and we got out of this trade with a really nice win. Um, each one of these was up around $650. So uh, we were up about $1,300 on these two for the day. And so that's per 25K traded. So that's a gain of about 5%. 
So what a day, um, up about 5% on the smart pivot strategy. And um, I'm trying to think what else, I, I, I guess I've covered quite a bit. Um, the If you have any questions on this strategy though, just re reach out to my company. If you've got about 25K available to trade, you could pick from the smart pivot. You could also look at the Trader uh, Plus package, which which trades similar algos. It trades basically uh, this one up here. It trades the day trade long V2 instead of the V1. And then instead of this one, it trades the Emerald Short. So the Trader Plus is one you could look at, um, which also would have been up the same amount, by the way. And then if you've got 35K though, then you know the Elite Trader is one that, that you could consider um, because it does trade all five strategies. So thanks again though for watching and uh, remember there's, there's risk in trading futures, it's not for everyone, but I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.